Welcome back to our town hall. Now, many families use the Memorial Day long weekend to travel and experts expect this year to be busy with people canceling or putting off plans in the past because of COVID. Well, AAA anticipates 40 million Americans will be traveling by car or plane over the next few days. Now, the travel website Hopper is reporting that the average cost of a round trip this weekend is $394. That's up 28% from 2019. So what happens if your flight is canceled and then you decide not to travel? Can you get a refund? Ariane Detail with our Verify team looks into that question. Ever had travel plans derailed by a canceled flight? Well, a viral TikTok has some advice for you. Actually, I read the terms. If a flight is canceled and I choose not to travel, I'm entitled to a full refund. But is that true? Let's verify. Can you get a full refund if your flight is canceled and you choose not to travel? Our sources are the U.S. Department of Transportation and Alaska, United, Delta, American, and Southwest Airlines. If an airline cancels a flight and the customer chooses not to travel, the U.S. Department of Transportation says customers are entitled to a refund regardless of the reason. These rules also apply to non-refundable tickets, though airlines can issue a credit or a travel voucher for those tickets as compensation instead of a refund. Verify looked at refund policies of major airlines in the U.S., and they offer either a full refund, travel credit, or a voucher for future travel if an airline cancels a flight and the customer chooses not to travel. DOT says if an airline or ticket agent refuses to give you a required refund, you can file a complaint with the DOT online. So we can verify, yes, you can get a full refund if your flight is canceled and you choose not to travel, including non-refundable tickets. With your Verify, I'm Ariane Till.